Well, if you haven't noticed by now, Georgia has become quite the hotbed for the television and film industry. In fact, some are now calling it the new Hollywood of the South. Yeah, Ray, even the Georgia ag industry is getting some time on the big screen. Thanks to award-winning director James Mull, Farmland is a highly anticipated documentary that gives viewers a first-hand glimpse into the lives of six young farmers and ranchers, including Crawford County Farm Bureau president and poultry farmer Layton Cooley. It's an emotional journey that shows both the highs and lows of a passion that is passed down from generation to generation. Here's a preview for you. What does the public want to know? What do they need to know? We're not hiding anything, but what do you want to know? There is a misunderstanding of where food comes from. You can't just wake up one day and say, I'm going to be a rancher. It doesn't work that way. The number of people coming back to the family farm has decreased substantially. There's a lot more challenges into starting farming than it used to be. When I started, no one believed in me. <sighs> Nobody. It's definitely tough being in this developmental stage of my business. You better water them right now. My dad started this farm. Now this is pretty tall. This is the legacy we are carrying on. Why does this not seem fair? <laughs> As a 26-year-old, I am, to my knowledge, the youngest rancher in Throckmorton County. We need to have young people go into farming. Who's going to grow our food? So there you have it. As mentioned, a lot of anticipation for this film and some very positive responses as well. Recently, the Georgia Farm Bureau held a private screening of the movie in downtown Macon. A large crowd was on hand, including Layton Cooley, as well as 25 of his family members, all there to share in Layton's big screen debut. Basically, the hope for the documentary is to create some dialogue between, create conversation between consumer and the farmer. You know, consumers have questions about their food, how it's produced, where, how it's grown, how it's raised, and those are valid questions. But the thing that we have to make sure is that farmers are answering these questions, you know, because because we're the ones that know it best. On our farms, we know what happens, what goes on. And so it's really just to create some dialogue and some conversation between the consumer and the farmer. Over 300 from the farming community and leaders in the area were on hand for the special premiere of the documentary Farmland. The group included many from the Georgia Farm Bureau staff and several elected officials. Some that attended told us they were interested in the movie for a number of reasons, including the storyline that describes the evolution of tradition, passing on the family business to the next generation. Farm Bureau President Zippy Duval said he was proud that a Georgia farmer, Leighton Cooley, was part of the nationwide conversation on farming and said those that watched the movie would see real emotion expressed by the farmers. Well, we're just real excited about having one of our young farmers uh, uh, being in this movie and, and having Georgia agriculture portrayed in this movie. It's going to be seen all over the country, and that's just a real exciting thing for us. By the way, the film's creator, James Mull, his work is well documented. Mull's credits include an Oscar, two Emmys, and a Grammy. The scheduled release date of the film is set for May 1st and will be distributed in more than 60 major markets, including Atlanta. Farmland will also be shown in Macon at the Douglas Theater on May 2nd.